Hello everyone, this is Paul from Pangolin. Today I'm going to show you how to do a timer on Beyond. Timers are useful when you want to do a show that starts a specific time. We go to playlist and we're going to add our show. Let's add the test show here. First thing we do is preload the show. So we set the preload flag. This enables the show to start right away because it, you don't have to load it. Now we're going to go to Pango script and do a new code. Well, first thing on our code, we're going to change the name. Let's call it a timer. Next, we can unram the auto start and the stop on blackout. This is going to allow the code to run automatically. And if you will ever need to stop everything by pressing the blackout key, you can just do it and the script is going to stop. So the first line, we're going to wait for time. So let's look at our command list. Wait for time. ST wait for wait for Q wait for time. Just by clicking on it, it appears on the code. So this is your time in hours, minutes, seconds, and milliseconds. And it's on the military format. So if it's six o'clock, now it's 18, let's say 44. So we're going to do this at 46. Next. We're going to play the playlist. So the command is a play playlist. We're going to P playlist play. Double click on it. There's our command. So this is it. Just by giving our OK, we can run our timer. And when the time comes at 6. 46, the show should start automatically. Well, it's about time. Here it comes. There's our show. Yep, that's how it works. And then we can stop the show here. And here in the bottom, you can see the code, which is pretty simple. Well, I hope you guys liked it. It's a good introduction to script and beyond. See you later.